Hello guys, Keith Wright on TV here, back for yet another video. Before we get into today's video, let's see if we can hit 200 likes, and as well if you haven't dropped a sub, make sure to smash that subscribe button. So it's finished in the Carabao Cup first round. Charlton Athletic nil, Birmingham City won. We progress through to the next round. This was Chris Davis's first Blues win as um, Blues, well his first um, professional win um, as Blues boss. And um, yeah, through to the next round, Keller scoring an absolute worldy of a goal, and that was his first Blues goal. He also copied Jude Bellingham's um, celebration as well. Um, so yeah, he copied Jude, uh, Jude Bellingham's celebration. And also, Jude Bellingham scored his first senior goal away at Charlton in a 1-0 win as well. So, you know, kind of crazy how, you know... They're so similar, um, you know, from what happened back um, when Drew got his uh, first goal for Blues, when Keller scored his first goal for Blues, both 1-0 wins and um, both good goals, to be fair, but I think Keller's are better than Jude's, to be fair. But yeah, for this game, the lineup obviously we made a lot of changes because we wasn't going to play our strongest team. Um, we don't really prioritise the Carabao Cup. If we get into the last stages of the tournament, then we probably will, to be fair. But yeah, in this um, for this game, sorry, we had um, Ryan Allsop in between the sticks, Sanderson and Clara as the two centre backs. And then we had Keller as the left back, Ethan Led as the right back. The two in the middle, um, the two in the middle, we had um, Tyler Roberts, and we also had um, Leonard, and then we had Keshi Anderson. Um, Hanson and uh, Luke Harris and then up top was the Duke, Luka Sikovic. Still starting, still got it in him as an E at the age of like 36, 37. But yeah, in this game, we gave away a penalty. I thought the passing, by the way, the passing in this game from Blues was a bit poor to be fair. I think it was Hanson that gave the ball away and Charlton countered. Tyler Roberts brought, them, uh, brought the player down. And that penalty that Charlton had, by the way, so, so, so poor. So, so, so poor. But, yeah, Charlton, I mean, I thought, you know, I thought in this game, you know, Charlton were pretty poor, to be fair, let's be honest. I did think we managed the game well, though. I liked the way we controlled the game. I liked the way that we're, we're building um, under Chris Davis. You know, we're controlling games and we're, um, you know, we're, we're getting... Hold of games when we go, you know, one nil up. I thought in this game, especially, you know, um, you know, Charles and yeah, had, they had their chances, but um, yeah, we'll get into the, the Keller goal now. Tyler Roberts lays it off to him. What an absolute belter of a goal that was! An absolute belter. We was lucky. Let's be fair. We was lucky to go not to go one nil down, but that penalty was so so poor. Like how poor was that penalty? Um, by the way, I thought Hanson, you know, he gave, he gave the ball away for the, for the um, goal leading. Well, not uh, obviously it wasn't a goal, but he gave the ball away leading to that Charleston penalty, that, which they did miss. But I thought in this game, you know, we played really well. I thought, I thought we played really well. There was some, you know, when we got into the final third, that final pass, it wasn't really there. But um, I thought we, we did really well in this game. Um, through to the next round as well, Chris Davis gets his first professional win as as a manager actually not only at blues as a manager that's his first win i completely forgot about that but yeah um of course sanderson got let's talk about sanderson sanderson got a red card so christian bielik had to come on that um well stampstead come on as well the new, the new right back that we um have and um yeah sanderson pulled the player back deserved yellow card to be fair but we saw the game out um, and, um, yeah, so, so happy with the win. Now it's on to, look, I know it's the cup, but I thought, I thought we needed that win, um, to be fair. We needed that win, you know, to get our confidence going. And yes, we've won games in pre-season, but we wanted to win. We wanted to, I, I, I wanted to win this game. And now we head, um, head into the Wigan, uh, Wigan, Wigan game, sorry, Wigan game this Saturday. Hopefully we can pick up another three points. And there's a, there's a small matter of Jay Stansfield. Reports, or should I say, rumours that he was actually, or you know, one of his family members was actually at the stadium watching the game. I don't know if that's true or not. But yeah, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Get that interaction going. Let's see if we can hit 200 likes. A brilliant, brilliant, well controlled performance from Blues tonight. Anyway, thanks for watching as always, guys. Let's see if we can hit 200 likes, like I said. Let's get that interaction going. Yeah, all that stuff. Thanks for watching. Keep on.